In this video, we are going to check out this little gadget right here. Cue the intro. What is happening, beautiful people? Jim here. Now, what I have is the TP Link AC1300 Wi Fi USB adapter. For less than $20 on Amazon, you can get a powerful dual band wireless network adapter for your laptop and or desktop. This wireless adapter supports both Windows XP all the way to 11 and Mac OS X 10.9 to 10.14. So as mentioned earlier, the TP-Link AC1300 has dual band capabilities, which means that I can have connection for both 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz, meaning you know we get both bands covered now this thing is tiny it does not have much on the physical aspect of it other than the male side usb and of course the tp link writing on the surface now speaking of the usb to get the best connection make sure you connect this to your usb 3 on your device look for the usb plug that has the blue in the middle something like this Although this would still work on USB 2. In addition to that, this little AC1300 also provides MU MIMO support. But honestly though, I am not familiar with that tech so I will not go into the details of that. So at this point, let us test the AC1300 Wi-Fi USB adapter and see if it is really fast. According to the TP-Link's website, the AC1300 delivers 400 megabits per second on the 2.4 gigahertz band and 867 megabits per second on the 5GH band. And let us compare that with my current Wi-Fi adapter, which is the Realtek RTL 8811AU wireless LAN. I could not get more information on the speed of this adapter, except that it should be good between 200 and 300 megabits per second. But just the mere fact that the TP-Link AC1300 has USB 3 support, it should make it a lot faster than the USB 2 that I currently have. Sadly though, I cannot separate the 2.4 and the 5G network, so we'll have to do with what I have. Let's go! All right, beautiful people, I am back. Now, as mentioned earlier, what we're gonna do first is we're gonna try out or test the Realtek RTL8811AU network adapter. And as you can see here, this thing is enabled. It's connected to my wireless uh, network and Spartan internet access. Then I went to Google speed test and we're gonna do the first one, run speed test. Let's do this. All right, it's not too bad. 40-ish no, uh, megabits per second on the download. And yeah, about 40.1 megabits per second download. And then for the upload, 33, 32-ish. Maybe 35 even, right? 35.5. Your internet connection is fast. So it's not too bad. I can do my um, HD streaming devices and all of that. Now, next is what we're going to do is we're going to try this. The TP-Link AC1300 USB 3. So like literally, I'm just going to stick this in, let the windows uh, recognize it, and then go from there. There. I don't know if you guys heard that. All right. But just to be on the safe side, what I'm going to do is I'm going to disable this one. All right. And as you can see, my Ethernet is also disabled. So now I only have TP-Link wireless USB adapter enabled and it is connected. So let's go ahead and test this. Whoa, <laughs> look at that. Wow. Hundred megabits per second for downloads compare that to 40 all right to 40 man look at this uploads is 92.1 92 ish around there megabits per second on for the uploads so my connection if i have the ac 1300 from tip link is very very fast you know do i recommend this absolutely absolutely 100 percent. i recommend this all right, beautiful people, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, share this to your friends, and if you want to purchase the TP-Link AC1300 USB 3 wireless adapter, I have the link down in the description box below. Would appreciate that. Would also help this channel as well. If you haven't, please consider subscribing, and as always, I will see you in my next one. Bye!